What is up guys, Rick Hack is here bringing you the infinite missile glitch. The recommended class for this is the destroyer and you need to use the striker, although you can also use the Vulcan, but use the striker, and the Grawl spike thrower, although you can use any charge up gun. Both of them should not be spec for damage, but ammo capacity in any way possible, and I'm going to explain why in a little bit. So you actually can't do this glitch as the leader, so you'll need, you'll need to find basically a lackey to host you if you want to be doing this. What you need to do is immediately switch to your Grawl or charge up weapon and then hold the shoot button and up on the d-pad for me so whatever select missiles is and hold those two at the same time for 10 seconds. When that 10 seconds is up, you'll let, you'll while holding the shoot button still, keep holding that, but you'll let go of the select missile button and then start holding X or whatever switch weapons button is. You hold those for 10 seconds, and then after that 10 seconds is up, let go of everything. Your guy will shoot his charged up shot and switch to the striker, and then as you can see, he'll be shooting missile launchers out of his striker. This glitch, uh, this is the new updated version of the glitch. Uh, this is not the old one. This works as of the up October update. So, um, an, an important thing to remember is while you're in the glitch, you can't do anything that involves holding X. So you can't do any objectives that involve holding X, and you can't... Um, revive teammates so if you're doing this with four people two people should be doing this glitch and two people should be the uh, kind of uh, what's it called the objective lackeys and the reviving lackeys and they should be the ones doing all the holding a stuff so you'll notice that when you're in this glitch and you go to an ammo thing nothing will happen and also when you even if you press uh, your refill ammo instantly, your thermal pack thing, nothing will happen. So you'll eventually slowly run out of ammo. Now, how you fix this is all you have to do is go to an ammo crate and go in and out of destroyer mode. So if you're out of destroyer mode, go into it, and if you're in destroyer mode, go out of it, and you'll instantly recharge your ammo, and you'll still be in the glitch and ready to destroy guys again. Now, morally, um, don't... Here's the thing, if you're gonna do this glitch, get some friends together and do it. Go, go nuts, okay? Or go into a party and make sure everything's okay with it. Um, everyone is okay with this glitch. Um, but don't just go into a public lobby and start doing this, because that's annoying. Like, how I found out about this is someone did just that. And you know, it was kind of nice because we easily won, but it also sucked because I was using uh, my best stuff. I was using like Cryo Rounds 4 and stuff, and I didn't need to be. That was all wasted. So that was kind of annoying. So if you do this glitch, Go ahead and do it. I don't really care. Um, if you have the best weapons, it can only help me. So, like I said, go nuts, but make sure everyone in the lobby is okay with it. Don't just start doing it, because that's kind of a douchebag move. Please subscribe, because I bring forth Mass Effect 3 content all the time. I started a new series called Mass Effect 3 In-Depth recently. And also, I'm going to bring you as soon a premium farming spot that's totally legit. This is technically cheating. Uh, my premium farming spot is nothing but legit and is even better than the old uh, white map. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, please subscribe, it really helps me out. And if you do, I guarantee you're going to see a lot of awesome Mass Effect 3 videos. And as always, have a nice day.